round seven of the TCR International Series at Portimao in Portugal, and making his debut in the series, pole sitter Nicky Team immediately had a fight on his hands from the man alongside him on the grid, Jordi Genet. Genet it was who reached turn one just in front, but the Audi TT was quickly back in the lead. Michel Nukia was the first to retire after a collision with his teammate Andrea Beliki, while the other target competition, Seat, would spend much of the race scrapping with the second Liquimon Team Enschler Audi. Stefano Camini lost fourth place on this occasion, but his battle with South Africa's Kelvin van der Linde would continue. Contact between the pair saw Camini come off second best, while it was Camini again who was involved in a collision, first with Gianni Morbidelli's Honda, and then Pepe Oriola's Seat on lap seven. On the very next lap, Morbidelli then made contact with Andrea Belicki's car, and the Honda joined the retirements list. That list grew still further on lap nine when Oriola came into the pits with a puncture. Van der Linde finally clinched fourth place by powering past Camini on one of the circuit's uphill sections, but it was Nicky Team in the other Liquid Molly Enschler Audi TT that took the win, the Audi becoming the third different brand to win a round of the TCR International Series. On to round eight, and it was the West Coast Racing Honda Civic and Kevin Gleason that started from pole. This time, the Sayat Leon of the man in second place, Michel Nukia, reached turn one in the lead. Again, Gianni Morbidelli would fail to finish after this collision with Lorenzo Velia's Sayat forced the Honda to limp back to the pits. Kelvin van der Linde was quickly up into second place, passing Gleason on lap four, and a battle for the lead soon developed between the Audi and the Seat of Nukia. For a while, it looked as though an Audi might well win both of the Portuguese races, but first Nicky Team suffered a puncture, and then van der Linde was forced to stop with an electrical problem, so the pressure was suddenly off Nukia. Camini was once again scrapping with Oriola, but this slide had nothing to do with the Kraft Bamboo look oil driver. Nukia took the victory, and so seven different drivers have tasted victory from the eight rounds held so far. What's more, both of the races in Portugal had been won by Danish drivers. I, the last two or three rounds, uh, I just uh, take it easy and save my tyres a little bit so nothing happened. And I was almost crying uh, when I'd uh, go uh, get the checker flag because crashed in first race and now win is uh, yeah um, it's it's incredible <laughs>